Shoppies, Shoppies, Shoppie Sunday. Yay! Hey guys, Stitches here. It's been a hot minute since I have been here doing a Shoppie Sunday video. I know, didn't you guys miss my annoying voice? <laughs> Alright, so today I have Valentina Hearts for you guys. She is like a mouse slash chinchilla type Shoppie. It's almost like a Pokemon, but not. Her artwork is so cute. She looks so just like adorable. I can't even. So Valentina Heart. She's from the Heart and Seek tribe from Wild Style. Here's the back of her box with her artwork and her cute little thing and the wristband. And then if you would like to pause and read about her, go right on ahead. And this is also look for in the new shop bet, sold separately, which I have right here, which is Squeak Sweetie. She is like a little mouse slash chinchilla looking thing. She's very cute. I'll open up the shoppy first and then I'll open up her. But if you would like to pause and read about Squeak Sweetie, go right on ahead. So funny. Alright, I'm going to slide this girl out of her box. Got my handy dandy little scissors. The okay, first thing I noticed off of the bat is that she has this shiny, it looks like the gel might have touched her face all over. She's got this nasty like clear thing. It's not showing up on camera, but I'm definitely going to have to wipe her face down very carefully with a magic eraser because it looks very sticky and hopefully I can get it out. Oh my gosh, her hair is so cute. Um, anyway, sorry for my little hiatus. I got really, really sick. Like I had this cough and I couldn't even talk really. And then I had some personal things happen in my life that I don't want to talk about. But I took some time. I'm here. I'm ready to be the shoppy reviewer you want me to be. Alright, my friends. I'm having difficulties. It's been a while. I'm out of practice. I'm out of practice taking these girls out of the box. Okay, so here are her two little Shopkin friends. There's that one. And there's that one. They're just going to stay in the packaging for now. Throw it over there. She has her little stand. Um, it has a paw print and some cheetah print around the edge. So cool. And then, so you would just attach it onto her foot with the hole. And then she stands nicely. She comes with this little photo strip of her and her shoppy or her, her shop at friend and her little Shopkins. Let me see if I can get it to focus on it. There's the first one. Cute. Here's the second one. Oh my gosh, look at her little smile. And here's the last one. My friend um, Amber, this is actually one of her favorite Shoppies. So, hmm. Oh my goodness. These, this wave has like the most softest hair, I have to say, because I'm literally just like messing with her little curls. I don't want to mess with them too much, but they're so soft. I mean, every doll is different, but this one is so soft, her hair. It's very frizzy, but that's okay. I don't mind. So, right off the bat, here's her face. I love how her bangs are shaped like a little heart on the top. She's got like little heart marks on her cheeks and she's got little heart eye shines along with the most perfect hot pink eyebrows. I mean, I wish I had hot pink eyebrows. Her eyeshadow is like a magenta color. Hmm. Her little headband has her little mouse ears along with a glittery heart that says love with a purple bow on top. Something I think is so cute is I don't know if it'll be able to catch it. Maybe it will. You can kind of see it. There are little streaks of like a lavender color within her hair. And it just, it looks so cute. I'll have to take a picture so then that way you'll be able to see it better. So I'll include it at the end. But she's so cute. And I love the, 
It literally looks perfect. My part is never perfect. When I do my hair in ponytails, it looks like a hot mess. And since I'm back here, I'll go ahead and talk about her tail. It's shaped like a heart on the end, and it's connected in the back. I think, I'm not going to try to take it out, but I think it can come out. And it's her lower back, not necessarily her butt that it's attached to. Her hands are actually straight down, which is unique because usually they're like bent in some awkward position. So she has nice hands. Her collar is like that purple color and she has two little hearts. There's a heart texture on her jacket, which is super cute. I love it. And her skirt is multi-level hearts slash the scallops look like little hearts. And it is just, oh my gosh. And the same, almost the same pattern that's there is kind of down here. I know for a fact, you probably can't tell the texture. Here, let me see. There's the texture of that. You can see it. Now let's see if I could get lucky. Hmm. Not necessarily. You'd sort of see it. There are a bunch of little hearts and they're indented into it. Her shoes match her headband and her shoes also match her shirt. She's just so cute. And oh my gosh, her heels say love. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Come on camera, please be nice. Well, she's probably going to have to go up to one of my top ten. Oh my goodness. One of her ringlets is a little longer than the other. A little annoying, but whatever. So I'm going to go ahead and put Miss Valentina down. And go ahead and open up Squeak Sweetie super quick. And show you what's going on with that. Oh my goodness. So she comes with a tinier version of the stand that's perfect for the little guys. Look at this cute little mouth. Honestly, to me, she looks more like a chinchilla, but I know she's supposed to be a mouse. The flocking is so soft. And then it looks like the inside of the ear was sprayed a lighter pink than the outer pink, if that makes sense. It looks like their headbands, or the little heart on the headbands, are almost identical, as you can see, except for one's covered in glitter and one's not. She's got these cute little mouth. The paint around her mouth is a little messy, but that's okay with me. She's got a very simple top that almost looks like a cupcake, an upside down cupcake with hearts. The scalloping around the end is hearts. If I could get it to, there we go, you can see it. See, they're like little hearts. So cute. Like if I, there, a shadow. Perfect. Her little pants have little hearts around the bottoms too. Cute little details. Her paws are a lighter color also. And her little tail is flocked and it's got a little curly on the end like a piggy. She's like a little piggy hybrid. So stinking cute. These two are just, I can't get over this. They are so cute. I love hot pink, and Valentine's Day is an okay holiday. I like the day after Valentine's Day more because, let's face it, half-off chocolate is amazing. These two look so cute together, and I cannot wait to put them on my shoppy shelf because my shoppy shelf is almost done. A lot of you guys have been asking for an updated shoppy collection video and that will be coming out very soon as soon as I'm done painting and opening up the shoppies that I currently have. I'm about seven shoppies away from having them all open so that'll be really cool. I'll go ahead and keep you guys updated on that and yeah. Uh, my question for you today is what is your favorite shape? That sounds like such a weird question but as a preschool teacher, people have favorite shapes. Trust me. Uh, they tell me every day. 
Um, I personally love hearts, and I love pink, and this, these two are just so stinking cute, and I can't handle it. Um, yeah, so let me know what's your favorite shape down below, and don't forget to like and subscribe. I'd like to get to 1,000 subscribers before my, bir before my birthday. I know that's not very likely, but hey, it's worth trying. <laughs> and anyway, thanks so much for watching, guys, and I will see you in my next video. Let's go on, Valentina. You ready?